Hi everyone. Welcome to the first of a series of videos that will help you manage and administer your teacher dashboard spreadsheets for those colleagues who are currently working at a Catholic Education Office primary school. My name is Donovan Chung and I'm the current CloudShare Support Officer supporting the teacher dashboard rollout. During this first video, I'll be teaching everyone how to add and delete students from their student spreadsheets. Firstly, let's locate our student data. When Teacher Dashboard was rolled out to your school, two spreadsheets would have been shared with you. If you can't remember how to get to these spreadsheets, locating them is very easy, as they, are, as they were created on Google Drive. All you need to simply do is to search for it in your search bar each school is distinguished by a unique school code. So if you know your school code, you can simply type that in. The one that I'm going to do was an example one which I've created. And as you can see, it's one of the first hits which comes up. There are two different types of spreadsheets that are being shared with you. One will contain the classes and the other will contain the students. Let's have a look at the student one first. In your student spreadsheets, you will see two unique columns. The first one is the student identity, which is their SIDSTU email address. The other is their unique class code, which was generated by each school's respective timetabling software. So keeping in mind, each school would use a different code for their classes and for their students. One thing to be mindful of is with the student identities. Please ensure that you have the correct student email in this column. Please ensure you have the correct student email in this row, as sometimes there are some variables with students given names, preferred names, or whether or not they have a number attached to the end of their name. It's always good to just double check in case you have a few similar students with similar names or emails. To add a student is very, very simple. Simply scroll to the bottom of your spreadsheet. As you can see at the moment, this spreadsheet is organized alphabetically then by year group. To add a new student, all you need to do is to simply insert their email address. For this example, we're just going to call this person student, uh, student number two. In the next column, which is their class code, you need to insert their unique class code. Just as an example, they're going to be in this particular primary class. So all I need to simply do is to copy it over and that's done. Please make sure you follow the formatting of the class code in which you want the student to appear in, otherwise Teacher Dashboard will not recognize that data. Once you have done this step, all you need to simply do is to go to the Teacher Dashboard site, submit a ticket, and the e-learning team here at Leichhardt will make the necessary changes for you. Alternatively, if you need to delete a student, all you need to simply do is either remove their class code or remove the student entirely and once again submit the ticket to the e-learning team. I hope this has been helpful. Thank you. Thanks for watching.